FNN. Headline News Update. Welcome, folks. We have the Dow Industrials trading now at 417, NASDAQ off 126, S&P's off 51. Gold, gold contract down $5.40, trading at 1672 an ounce. We have silver down 11 cents, $19.24 an ounce. Light sweet crude off a buck 28, $84.45 a barrel, notes and bonds. You get the 10 year down 17 ticks, trading out at a price point of 113.26. The 30 year off a full point plus four ticks at 129.26. And the third, the uh, 10 year folks, uh, bottom line is an all time high for the 10 year this, uh, come this year. We are at 3.571. And King Dollar just won't give it up, man. King Dollar uh, is up 473 ticks, trading 110,209. The euro is 99. The yen is out here at 143. And the British pound is at 113 to 1 US dollar. Now, all of that said and done, check it out, man, because if we get over to the spy, this is actually bullish what's happening here. And what you have, what we've done here is this you're going to have a big contraction of volume just before the Fed. You hit a low, and it's rejecting it. So that's telling me that, guess what? Fed day tomorrow, you're going to have upside action. You know, the what we did out here this morning, we got to uh, 381, 195. Um, you tested yesterday with a low was uh, 382.17. The day before was 382.11. Um, and of course, guess what? It's never easy, folks, because we don't have the same thing in the NDX, okay? <laughs> So, what do you have in the NDX? We'd have in the NDX. It would have been really sweet, man. It just didn't test it, man. Well, actually, let me go look at the futures. So, the, the Qs did not test it. That's the bottom line. Let's see if we, yeah, and it didn't. It didn't test it. So, that's a wild card, man. That's the bottom line. That's going to be a wild card. Um, notes and bonds. We go take a look at the note and bond market. What do you have in the note and bond market is that uh, we've done 1.3 million contracts. You're going into lows. Uh, bottom line, it's been a one-way trip on the way down. We'll see whether that gets any juice. And then um, the dollar just won't give it up. You know, all that said and done, though, um, that's telling me, uh, you know, you can. there's no doubt I can make the case that, listen, this dollar wants to go back to the high of 110s. The dollar wants to basically go up to 121. But I like how the S&P is coming into that number. So my take on this is that, Whatever, you know, when the announcement comes out, folks, the market will go up and down. My take is that uh, we just tested, we rejected the lows, and um, my, my take is we're going higher. So we'll see how this shakes out. Gold, we look at the, and in order for that to happen, too, the bottom line is that um, that doll is going to.